Hello everyone, this is Mayank Sangvi from vlamon.com and I'm back with another Tableau tutorial video and in this video we will learn how to install Tableau desktop on Windows machine. For this video we are going to refer to this blog post, the blog post URL is available in the description of this video or you can click on this notification icon. Tableau desktop is available for Windows or Mac machine. So you can only install Tableau desktop on Windows or Mac. If you are looking for Linux version then unfortunately. Linux version is not available for Tableau desktop. Following are the required configuration to install Tableau desktop on your machine. You required Windows 7 or later. For Mac users, you required OS 10, 10.11 or later. Hardware requirement, RAM minimum 2 GB and hard disk available disk space is around 2 GB. We will install Tableau desktop on our Windows Server 2012 VM machine and our VM configuration is Windows Server 2012 64 bit installation with 6 GB RAM and 50 GB available hard disk space. So let's let's see how to install Tableau Desktop on our Windows Server 2012. First we need to download Tableau Desktop. For Tableau Desktop we have two versions. First one is the free Tableau Public Desktop and another one is Tableau Desktop Trial. We are going to install both the version and then we are going to check the difference between both the versions. To download Tableau Desktop Public, you need to click on this URL. On this page, you need to provide your email address and then you need to click on download the app. Once you are going to click on download the app based on your OS, this site is automatically going to provide the correct download. So if I'm going to click on this download app and I'm using Windows machine, so that's why a uh, download for Windows is going to start. For me, I already downloaded this file, so that's why I'm able to see it in my download folder. Tableau Public Desktop 64-bit edition 2018-2-2.exe. Okay, so let me quickly click on cancel. Now, to download Tableau Desktop Trial, you need to visit this URL. Click on this URL for personal group or online training. Contact us. On this URL, you are going to find all the available releases for Tableau. I'm only interested in the latest version. So that's why I'm going to select this 2018.2 and under this, I'm going to select 2018.2.2. And then finally, I'm going to click on this download desktop 2018.2.2. And then again, we have two options. Now, the OS related option. If you are a Windows user, feel free to download this one. And if you are a Mac user, you need to download this one. Again, I already downloaded this file for this video. So I'm, going to, I'm not going to re-download the same. So let's copy both the installation file inside our Windows Server 2012 VM. So this, this is my Windows Server 2012 VM. So I'm going to open my download location. It is available in D drive and I'm going to copy these two files minimize and I'm going to paste it. First, we are going to install Tableau Desktop Public. The installation for Tableau Desktop and Tableau Desktop Public is very simple. You need to simply double click on the installer icon. So I'm going to install, I want to install Tableau Public Desktop. So I'm going to click on this first exe file, double click on this. And this is the Tableau Public Desktop installation wizard. On this, you need to click on this. I have read and accept the terms of the license agreement. And then if you want to customize anything, you can click on this customize. You can select the installation location. You can control the create shortcut option based on this two checkbox. And finally check for the Tableau product updates. I'm fine with this default option. So I'm going to click on install. Now the installation for your Tableau public desktop is started successfully. Wait for the installation to complete. Installation for Tableau public desktop is completed successfully and this is the splash screen for Tableau desktop. And finally, this is the start page for Tableau public desktop. Next, we are going to install Tableau desktop trial version. For this, I'm going to first minimize this and then I'm going to select the second installer file. Okay, double click on this to start the installation for Tableau trial version. Again, the same welcome wizard, accept the license term if you want to customize, feel free to click on customize button, but this time I'm going to click on install button. Installing Microsoft ODBC driver 13 for SQL Server. Installation, installation for Tableau desktop trial is also completed successfully and installer is auto closed. 
Now I am waiting for Tableau Desktop first launch. Okay, so this is Tableau Desktop Professional Edition split screen. And finally, this is the Tableau Desktop Trial Activation Window. So I'm going to click on Start Start Trial now. If you have an activation key, feel free to use the activation key. It is very simple. You need to click on Activate and then you need to provide the product key. So I'm going to close this and let's try to launch it one more time. And this time I'm going to select Start Trial now. And here we need to provide our uh, personal information so let me quickly fill all this information and finally i'm going to click on this register button and registration is completed successfully so let me quickly click on continue and this is tableau desktop trial version okay now the ui for both is almost same so let me arrange my windows so i can show you the UI for Tableau Desktop and Tableau Desktop Public. Both are the same product, so definitely the UI is going to be same. The option, the number of option in case of Tableau Desktop is more if you are going to compare it with Tableau Public Desktop. With Tableau Desktop, you can connect with uh, database servers. You can also connect with server, but this options are not available in case of Tableau Public Desktop. In Tableau Desktop trial, we have an option to connect it with Microsoft SQL Server. So I can connect it with Microsoft SQL Server. I can select my database. I can import database tables from SQL Server database. But this database servers option is not available in case of Tableau Public. Rest of the thing is same. But another difference is we have an option to upgrade our Tableau Public Desktop. In the menu, the server. Okay, we can connect it with server, but same server option is not available in Tableau Public Desktop. So this is about the installation. Before closing, I want to install one more thing. For this, I'm going to open my blog post. And after the installation, you may require to download additional drivers. Okay, so let's say if you want to connect to a database server, then you can download the respective database drivers and you can start using it with your tableau so to download any data source drivers you need to click on this url this is going to open tableau support page on tableau support page you need to search for download drivers it is available under quick links section click on download drivers and then search for your required driver so let's say i want to connect it with microsoft sql server then i'm going to search for microsoft sql server i want to select windows operating system because i'm using windows or windows operating system and then your windows version whether it is a 32 bit or 64 bit I'm using a 64 bit version so that's why I'm going to select this and then based on your filter you are going to get the download link click on download link uh, please read this line for Tableau desktop version 9.3 and later Microsoft the Microsoft SQL Server driver is by default installed so you don't need to download it and reinstall it okay in case of Microsoft SQL Server it is already installed so if for you if you are using some other data source and for your data source driver is not available then definitely you need to visit this page you need to filter out your data source and based on your operating system you need to download the appropriate driver and finally install those driver inside your windows or mac machine okay so this is about the installation of tableau this is about installation of drivers so we are done with the installation in our next video we will learn about tableau desktop user interface okay so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video don't forget to click on likes subscribe share it with everyone provide your feedback and see you all in next tableau desktop tutorial video some important URLs.